Hey, Kath, good luck. What's your answer? Janitor. A janitor. And he always had a house, didn't he? He always had a he house did. right next to the school. Uh, I called mine the caretaker. Janitor. <laughs> not a janitor. Not one of the answers that we've got here. Uh, I've got four answers here which are familiar. So if you should say a janitor, okay, uh, and there, there, there it is, actually. Uh, if you think of a janitor, you know that's familiar. He's, he's, he was the man or woman, it was a man in my day, uh, that would walk around in a, in a brown overall or a brown coat and he'd always have a dog and, he'd, and, and as you walk past him, he'd go, behave yourselves and pick that up. Uh, you know the janitor I mean, yeah? Um, actually, he didn't really sound like that because I, li I, 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 li I lived in Essex, so it was like, all right, Stop my, no, no, forget it. I've got a caller. Uh, hello, you're on the air. What's your name? Hello, it's Sharon. D did you say your name again? Sharon. Hey, Sharon. Good luck. What's your answer? Uh, GCSE. GCSE. All right. GCSE, is it one of the eight answers, please? Have you passed? <laughs> no, you're going to fail. No, not GCSE. Everyone else back in. Have a really close look at this, all right? Have a really close look. I am looking for things associated with school. Try and find something familiar and keep your fingers crossed that it's one of our seven familiar answers. Hello, you're on the air. What's your name? Hi, it's Tracy. Hello, Tracy. Hello. Hello. Uh, good luck. Go. Thank you. A uh, pencil. A pencil. A pencil. Uh, no, 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 no. Not looking for pencil. 09056 54 54 54 and as you can see I did I did not lead her towards that answer did I no 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 I'm feeling sharp mm, get out mm. uh, <laughs> sometimes I do wish there was a script I hope you've had a good day uh, I hope you're gonna have fun uh, uh, most of you may go to go to bed tonight after this game uh, thinking about maybe when you were at school and the first person you ever fell in love with because uh, everyone falls in love at school at some point, don't they? Um, I do remember actually when I was about. I'm waiting for another call to come through. It is a speed round. All the answers are in the uh, in the grid here. Um, I do remember I, my, the first ever girl I ever went out with at school. Her name was Samantha, and we went to uh, a place called uh, Warrior Square Swimming Pool, which is in South End. And I went with another friend of mine called Darren, and he and he was really loud. He was really cheeky, always always pushing his girlfriend into the uh, into the swimming pool and stuff. And at the age of like nine, Samantha turned around to me and said. Why don't we have as much fun as them? <laughs> I'm like, I don't know. I'm like seven or eight. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, hello, you're, you're live on air. What's your name? Lillian. Uh, hello, welcome. What's your answer? Head boy. A head boy. Okay, where are you calling from? Portsmouth. Portsmouth. How long was it since you were at school? Oh, what's your years ago? Really? Yeah. Oh, okay, well... It gives me great pleasure to say to you, because I've just been told in my ear, you have just passed your first exam this evening. Uh, you have got an, a winning answer. It is answer number six. You've just won £500 for saying head boy. Yay! Yay! That ain't, that's not bad, is it? Not bad at all. Many congratulations to you. Are you there still? She's gone to speak to the headmaster. All right, she's got a 500 pounds. Okay, so now you've got a real great example of how it works. Uh, to celebrate this, uh, to celebrate that win, I'll take the money up. I'll make it now 750 pounds. Now, do remember the rules of the game. You can go from the bottom to the top, top to the bottom, right to left, left to right. You can go diagonally across the board to find answers. If you do go diagonal, stay on a diagonal angle. Do not veer off if you find anything. And remember your answer can go forward or backwards. And you can also snake at right angles. I'll give you an example of a snake. There we go. That's an example of a snake at right angles. Okay, stop the music, please. I want you to really focus in on this game while I tell you this information. Just subconsciously listen to what I'm saying, but look at the board. It will cost one pound to call me from a BT landline. Other networks, they may charge you more. Mobiles will cost considerably more, so set a limit, stick to it, as all calls are charged, whether you're selected to come through to me here in the studio or not. I take each caller randomly from people on hold when the phone in the studio rings. I've got an alternative entry, quizcall.co.uk. There you can see our terms and conditions and our fair entry policy. Make sure you're over 18, have Bill Pairs permission, and if you want our T's and C's in writing, 
writing right to the address at the bottom of the screen. Okay, this is now where it gets more exciting for me. I'm offering you £750 guaranteed if you can match one of our answers. This is going to be a speed round. There are people out there watching right now that haven't even dialed the number that will get through. Will you be one of them? We're about to bring in the music. We're about to get excited for £750. England, Scotland, Ireland, Wales, cast your eyes and your mind back to the days of school. Look in the grid and find things associated with school. Give me my music now. Who's going to be the first caller through? 09056 54 54 54. Alternative entry quiz call .co.uk. £750 guaranteed when my phone in the studio rings. I'm going to talk to somebody first caller of this round. Hello, who's on the line? It's Helen. Hey, Helen, you're through to the studio. What's your answer? Pupil. A pupil? Yes. S spell it just to be sure. P-U-P-I-L. Thank you very much indeed. I see what you're saying. <laughs> uh, no, not looking for pupil. Everyone else back in. 09056 54 54 54 alternative metrequizcool.co.uk. Um, what are you thinking about? What have you found? Answer number seven's familiar. Walla walla walla. It's inside that grid. Answer number three's familiar. Guess where it is? No, it's there. Uh, somewhere. Uh, hello, who's on the line? Hi, it's Nicola. Hello, Nicola. What's your answer? Uh, French. French? French. That's things associated with school. Let's see if you're going to get a, a, a we or a no. Uh, you get a no. Uh, no, not, not French. 09056 54 54 54 Alternative Entry Quiz Call dot co dot UK. Uh, £750. I'm looking for every single person watching this show right now to get involved as long as you uh, set yourself a limit because all calls are charged. When the phone rings and it's right there next to me, um, I will speak to somebody out there. 